So my job here is duty manager at Salford Student Village. Usual day at work, start at 3 o'clock, uh, work till 11. So I come in, have a couple of hours in the office. I usually, um, there's usually most people around till about 5. Um, I'm on the desk till usually about 7. Just dealing with inquiries, whatever, you know, phone calls, students coming to the desk, paying rent, whatever. Then after that, it depends what needs doing. Where I worked last time was a hotel, so it's 24 hours. And although it is the same here, it's still someone on site 24 hours. It's not like an office that's nine to five and then it's closed down at night. It's different here because it's, I don't know, security takeover. I don't know, it's more, I'm able to just turn off when I go home and not be here. I think any job is stressful. I think there are parts of it that are and parts of it that aren't. And for me, it's finding that balance and this has it. There are bits that, yeah, maybe, you know, I do find stressful. I think anybody would. But there are more things that I find not stressful that I enjoy that compensate for the bits that I do find stressful or hard to do, maybe. And I think that's what you would look for in a job anyway. I started getting panic attacks when I was 19. Um, and it was one of the reasons I dropped out of university and I still have them now so a lot of my past work and stuff has been around managing that. I don't want to think what I could do, you know, like I could go around the world but I can't fly. I could go and work in the city centre but I can't go into Manchester. So I tend not to think about, I work my life around what I can do and this is what I can do and what I enjoy doing so I'm happy doing it. About two, three weeks ago, um, on Monday when I'm off, uh, took Pete, my other half husband, uh, we went and parked at Bromall and walked up because it's close to Manchester because I can't, I could never drive there, and walked into Manchester and managed to stay for about half an hour. And that was like the first time in 12 years that I've been into Manchester. I'm very much about doing what I do now. I know it sounds strange not to have dreams. I have, you know, everyone has things they want to do, but. I don't, I believe in living now and for now and I enjoy what I do and for now this is what I want to do.